Hi, I'm Rachel, and welcome to my channel, La Brigo Liz, where I share tips, techniques, and equipment spotlights from over 25 years working as a costume craftsperson. In this video, I'll demonstrate how I use an industrial heat press in creating costumes for performance and display. This is not a paid promotion. This is the Ricoma flat heat press with a clamshell mechanism and a 16 by 20 inch heat platen. In the studio where I work, we use it to adhere heat transfers and decals. I've also worked places that used similar equipment to adhere large pieces of fusible interfacing and processed foss-shaped thermoplastic felt yardage before using it as stiffened flat goods. You can choose the temperature of the platen and the duration of the press. Turn the press on and allow it to heat up. This can take several minutes, so I put up a warning sign to notify my coworkers that it's heating. Our press was manufactured in China, and the instructions that came with it were not clearly translated. After I set it up and determined how to operate it, I rewrote a more concise overview and printed it on the back of the warning sign, which is laminated and posted above the press. Make sure that the fabric or garment you'll be processing is smooth and wrinkle-free on the platform of the press. Wrinkles may result in an uneven transfer and can be difficult or impossible to press out after the process. In this demonstration, I'm using the equipment with a printable transfer product you can use with inkjet printers. This is an image from an entomology textbook, and here I'm peeling away the paper backing. I'm customizing a t-shirt for Lydia Diamond's play, Stick Fly, produced at Playmaker's Repertory Company with costume design by Pam Bond. You'll see the finished shirt at the end of the video. Make sure to use a layer of parchment paper between the transfer and the heat platen so you don't melt the vinyl. I also use this press with graphical vinyl transfers made on a computer-controlled cutting plotter like a Cricut or Silhouette. Time to engage the press. 60 seconds elapse. It plays a somewhat sorrowful tune when your press time is up. And here's the finished t-shirt with the entomology illustration graphic. For more video demonstrations of equipment I use in creating costumes, check out this playlist. You might find something to streamline production in your own studio. Again, this video is not a paid promotion. 